Hey everyone, I'm Tara Melton from Magnet Forensics. Today we're talking about the newly released Axiom Cyber and how it can help you in some of your investigations. I'm going to be looking at a fraud examination in this video. And so I have Axiom Cyber open with some evidence items already loaded in and ready to process. Under processing details in the section categorize pictures and videos, you can see that Axiom Cyber includes some specific Magnet AI capabilities that could be really useful in a fraud investigation. Magnet AI uses machine learning to search content and automatically identify relevant photos or chat records based on the categories selected by the examiner. In the case of a fraud examination in which we believe that documents may have been manipulated, certain AI functions such as documents or screen captures could be useful to you, so I'm going to go ahead and check those off for processing. Switching over to examine, I already have my case processed by Axiom Cyber with these AI categories selected. On the right hand side, you'll see the hits that Magna AI identified in my evidence sources that I processed. When Magna AI runs, it will automatically tag its hits as you can see here. I can click on these links, and that will take me to the Artifacts Ex Explorer. And by doing that, a filter is automatically applied for just those AI hits. I'm going to focus on the user's OneDrive files in their Office 365 account that was acquired by Axiom Cyber. I see that there's a couple of files that were identified as screenshots by Magnet AI that look to be like some sort of loan details with almost the same file name except that one of them is labeled as updated. I can click on the original and um, zoom in here and take notice of the amounts that are in the original file. And when I look at the updated file, zooming in, it looks like the loan amounts may have been manipulated to a higher amount. I'm going to remove this filter and I want to see what other files are found in the OneDrive files artifact. And we do see a couple of documents with a similar naming scheme that we might want to look into further. This updated one, if I scroll through and look at the loan details here, it looks like it may have been manipulated to that higher loan amount. If we wanted to see where else this file has been and maybe who's accessed it, we can build connections from it by clicking on that icon. And when it switches to the connections view, we'll peruse around a little bit. We can see that this file has also been stored on the user's hard drive in a folder that says waiting for approval. And then over here, you can see that the document was sent from our user under investigation to another individual. So you can see that Axiom Cyber has many features that can help jumpstart your investigation, in this case, a fraud examination, such as acquiring Office 365 data, using Magnet AI, and building connections across your evidence sources. We hope you check out Axiom Cyber today. Thanks for watching.